You may go. Your Grace. You must be curious as to the reason for this private audience. The matter I would discuss, however, will soon make apparent the need for discretion. I intend to abdicate the throne, and dissolve the monarchy. You have seen for yourself the storm of turmoil that howls through our streets. The government fails in its responsibilities, and my subjects suffer the consequences of our incompetence. But I will see them suffer no longer. The Victory Feast shall provide the stage on which I declare the dissolution of the Sultanate. Tis mine intent that the ruling class of our Golden City should take its place beside the common man in a fair and equitable republic. No more shall this nation bow to the whims of a privileged few. Yet, that which I propose will entail the tearing up of this city's very foundations. And even Roban, with all his strength and influence, will be hard-pressed to keep his footing on such treacherous ground. Thus would I ask you to lend him a steadying hand. You who have endured the wrath of innumerable foes are the one hero in whom I can place my trust. Will you do this thing for me? I am truly grateful. More grateful than I can well express. How much we have both changed since that day we met beneath the Sultan Tree. And the days ahead promise to change us further still. I hope that we will recognize ourselves when all of this is over. Her grace, the Sultana, is dead. Uh, poison in her wine? You! You did this! your denials. I see no other suspects, and the room has but the one entrance. I hereby accuse you of regicide. Men, arrest this viper.
Sir, barring a few exceptions, we have detained all those with allegiance to the Scions. The Rising Stones is also under our control. And what do you hope to achieve with this mutiny? Why, that which we have striven for all along, Commander. The salvation of Eorzea. 